With a name like Tunnel Phil, it better fill a tunnel. What type of panda nation? Peter Von Panda out here in my yard, and I have a rodent hole. You might be able to see that. Uh, they have been at it a while, and they're frustrating because they're kind of like boomerang kids. They just move in, and you don't expect them, and they're not a big deal at first, but then they start eating the food in your refrigerator, and they don't pay you any rent, and eventually they just become a burden on you, and they take all these liberties. You know how they are, these millennial rodents, but one of the things that I wanted to do here is fill this up. One, to get rid of the rodents, but two, to also make sure that no one hurts themselves, like a dog doesn't get its paw in there and break it. I don't step in and roll my ankle, any of those types of things, but most importantly, just to make sure that we don't have them coming back. Now, I bought this product. It's called Tunnel Fill, and it looks like it's going to be pretty easy to use. It's got a gopher on there. It comes in this big bag, and one of the things that I like about this, it appears to be environmentally friendly, and I think it will absorb water and expand and fill the tunnel, and it kind of looks a little bit like kibble. They're just these little circular pellets here, and they kind of look like dirt. So the way we're going to do this is I'm just going to take a couple handfuls of this and put it down the hole, and then we will take a hose, and we're going to use the high pressure setting to flush the pellets all the way down to the bottom. And then I think they will expand, and if you have not completely filled the tunnel, it says to kind of repeat. And so we will use the hose here for a few minutes to flush it down there, uh, let them inflate, and then I will continue to add it and just repeat the process until the hole is eventually filled. couple handfuls of this stuff. Dump it on in there. Looks like this hole goes pretty deep. I'll flush it down. All right, what I'm actually excited about is, I don't know, I probably put nine or 10 handfuls of the fill in there and kept flushing it down. And what you can see here is I've only got about two inches to go. So this stuff is actually expanding and filling up this hole pretty nicely. Now I did take one of the pellets and just put them out to the side here and watered it down. And I wanted to show you what it looks like. Kind of looks like a uh, donut hole. It's gotten much squishier. It's kind of inflated here, but it has like these crystals on the outside. They're hard when you put them in there, but they get kind of spongy after they get wet, which is no surprise just to take up all that room. So I'm just gonna put a few more in there and just water this thing up. And I think that's all I'm gonna need to do. So. The great thing about this is this tunnel fill was pretty efficient. You can see how much of the bag I used there, not a whole lot. And now I don't have to worry about this hole being a home for a leech stealing all my resources and eating all my Captain Crunch before I even get any. You know what that's like. Hey, if you want to pick up tunnel fill, I will put a link to it in the description below. Peter Von Panda, out.